Welcome back to the YNR After Show. Hi. It's time. We're back. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so, what do we have to talk about today? This beauty of nature scandal that's happening right now. Stupid Victor just can't leave well enough alone. He's got, everything is personal. It's not business. Yeah, it's course. always personal. Of course. And it's I nice. actually, I like the, I, I like the idea of Abby and Nick and Victoria all working for, for different companies. companies yeah. Um, Nikki's gonna go drunk again. Nikki's looking keep, hot. Yeah, she's looking really good. That blue dress. And that dress and that messy hair. Oh, yeah. She's looking good. She's looking good. She's looking great. And she's going to go after Jack. I think they're going to get together. I think I'm excited too. about it. I am too. I am too. I need... Ugh, I'm annoyed with Victor. Always, as always. Is something... Why, why is he in Japan with Genevieve? Yeah, what is... Okay. Like, wh what I don't understand is he sent her there. And yeah. then in the previews for next, for next episode, he shows up and he's like, why are you here? You yeah. knew I'd be here. She didn't know he'd be there. What's no, going on? And why Why do you have to meet, like, so far away? Like, hello? Just do where you are. Because Go he to Crimson to, Light. He has to show his power. He has to make her... Uh... <sighs> Whatever. She's annoying me. They deserve each other. You know... Who... I really... I think she's a terrible person. I also want to point out the fact that at first, when she came on the show, she was, like, mentally unstable. Like, completely. She was crazy. Yeah. And wanted to kill people and... Uh, Just call in. Yeah, but then the whole thing about Samantha being dead and her... Like, she's... She was she's nutty. crazy. And all of a sudden, she's a powerful businesswoman? She's not powerful. She pretends she is. Mm, she's trying. Whatever. Victor's gonna show her. Um, he's also trying to push or Nick her. and Sharon back together, which I'm yes. not... Which Happy I am about. excited. Why can't he just leave them alone? They don't yeah, belong together yes, anymore. They do. No, they're in the past. They're a thing of the past. Just like Phyllis and Nick. No, Nick and Phyllis are to, are now. They are the yeah, they are the present. Honestly, like Phyllis said before, like it's almost better if Nick and Sharon are together so she can stop being scared of heartbreak. As much her. as I don't like Phyllis, she does she doesn't deserve to be dragged in their business. All the time. Well, it's maybe true. Sharon should just that. go away. But the problem is not Sharon. It's Nick, too. They both have this... Nick's over her, and Victor is trying to push them back together. So then why did Nick agree to do the company thing? I don't know. He makes stupid because decisions. he did that because he was scared that Victor would hire Adam to do it. Because he sounded so smart in that board meeting. He should hire Adam to do it. No, because then Nick will be jealous of Adam. Adam needs to go to jail. Let's talk about him not being blind anymore. Here mm. we go. Is he going to tell everyone he can see? No, because he's a vindictive little snake. Which is what we love. We love to see that. Yeah. Um, but you're finally getting your wish. He's finally starting. All his things are starting to come out and people are, are starting to arrest him. <laughs> and then let him go. Yeah, I don't know. They just can't make it stick. No. Daisy? Daisy. How can you afford... What she... Because they, they finally right. explained because that it was all Sarah's, Sarah's money. Um, but but she should she, be in jail. The way she set up Phyllis was disgusting. Yeah. We hate her. I hate Daisy. I want her to die. And the fact that she thinks that her and Daniel are actually going to be it's a sick. family it's is sick. disgusting. She's sick in the head. She's like a, a creep. lot of people on this show. Yeah. Like Ricky, for one. Yeah. Who's upsetting. He's really upsetting. What he's doing to Paul... Mm, it's not right. Paul doesn't need this right now. Paul needs support. Paul was a Paul, terrible thought. Paul could have spent time with... Paul could have raised him. He could have. He could have. But he didn't. Uh, let, you know. There was no reason why he didn't. There's nobody that's a good father on this show. Except for Nick, Billy. Nick and is Nick a good father. And Kane. Nick's a great father. And Kane. Kane. Well, besides... When he's not pretending to be dead, he's a good <laughs> <Yeah>. father. <laughs> and, and Billy. Billy is Now. A, ever whoa. since his life has changed... Yeah. He's a, he is a good father. He loves. He just keeps getting into him into trouble. I know, but I love Billy. Jack's a terrible oh. father. Ooh, they might be bringing Kyle back as a teenager, which I think oh, is good. Oh, good. Not the... Finally. I hate that kid. I hated yeah. him. Yeah, like, who's Kyle with right now? He probably should be with Jack. Yeah, he, like, Jack has custody. He's just in Switzerland or something. Ugh, rich people. Where Nick went to age and, Cher and, and Victoria went to age. That's where they go to age. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Nick's looking mighty fine. He's a good looking fella. But, um... Those Nicks, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm looking awful today. <laughs> um, what else is happening? Oh, Adam's new friendship with, um, Chelsea. Chelsea? She's a little schemer. She's just she's... desperate. She, everyone hates her, so she's gonna team up with 
Adam. They have a kind of... They seem to really be actually getting along, though. Like, they seem to actually have yeah. a friendship. Like, she seems to respect him. And she he... reminds me of Sky a lot. Yeah, she's very Sky. A lot. She is very Sky. And I but think... Sky was smarter. Yeah. What I think... Well, Sky's still going to come back, probably. <laughs> <laughs> what I think is going to happen is that her and Adam are going to get close, and then when she gives birth, Adam, it, despite of Victoria and the Newmans, is going to try to convince her to keep the baby and raise them together or something really evil. They need... You said earlier off the screen, you said... <laughs> Offline. That you, you won't be able to handle it if they lose another baby, Vic, Billy true, and Victoria. It's true, it's true. They've been through so much heartbreak. Oh... The miscarriages and the... Lucy! Kid, and even Reed being taken even away Reed. from her. Because Mac's a good mom. Ugh, Mac, I hope she never comes back. Never utter those words again. I think she will. One day. No. I know, I don't want it either. Um, it was really nice how Nikki threw that birthday party. And it was really shitty of Victor to invite Sharon and Genevieve. And Genevieve. Especially God. Genevieve. Like, go away. And I like the way Victoria went... No hugs. No. Um, Jack's going to recover soon, probably. Probably. Well, Adam has, so it's only a matter yeah, of time for Jack. it's only a matter of time. Yeah, and I'm over him being in the wheelchair. Me too. Oh, another thing I'd like to talk about is Devon. Ugh, all his stuff is so boring. But Neil? Harmony? Mm. Ugh, like, come on. Harmony's trash. Let's not forget. She's like a coked up hooker. Yeah. Like... Don't let her fool you. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Like, he ruined everything to be with Sophia. Ah, uh, yeah. Which was and they have no chemistry. No, they're not even trying to make them seem like a couple. No. And now, yeah. Every time someone like Tucker calls Moses Little Mo, I think he's talking about like a little gay person. <laughs> little Mo. Uh. Ooh, I want to talk about Ashley's hair. I think it was last week. She did something really great that's inspired me to try it. She had her hair straight down, and on one side, she had it, like, twisted back here, so it was almost like a braid, and this side, it was just straight down. Okay. It was the scene where Genevieve went to talk to her, and whatever, they yelled at each other. Anyways, I just... Putting it out there, it popped in my head. She All right, really so George great. Guzman, if you did that and you're watching, why don't you do a tutorial on Ivanka? I would be so happy. Oh, it looks so good. It was so smart. I love the one side down and the one side tucked up. Oh. I love Ashley as the CEO. I think oh, yeah. she's a powerful she businesswoman and she's bossing she around Jill. She great. And I was, when I was looking at her, I was like, God, she looks so good. And then I remembered how she used to look and I was like, good God. Everyone looks so much better older yeah people age so well on this show Nick. mind you you're thinking of them when they were like in the 80s yeah. and 90s when style wasn't That's as true. good as it is now That's i mean it was for the time but but everyone's hair is looking great i'd like sharon's to be wavy again the like straight i like the dark layered. I, yep the dark is great suits her suits her well mm -hmm. um yeah, yeah. okay well, i think it's good for this anything week else? yeah and you got anything else to say anything else you want to add just write it in the comment box or send us something yeah, on Twitter. send us some questions. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, uh, we hope so, you love us because we love you. Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy. <laughs>